Hi, I would like to demonstrate how to modify one of the supplied project galleries. First of all, go to File, New Project, then select one of the galleries from the Gallery folder. I'm going to choose Gallery 1. Check that where it's going looks OK, and press OK, and it'll copy from the template to your nominated folder. Now I'm going to change the photos that are supplied in the gallery, first of all by removing the ones that are there. You may not have to do this and then I'll just go to my photo folder and choose some different photos. I'm using shift click to select a group of photos. Now if I press OK it should add the photos to the gallery and I can preview the gallery by pressing the preview button and it'll export the file and should show you those photos. I'll stop the preview and now I'm just going to change some of the colors. So you go to the colors group and you can choose a different background color and different control panel color and so on. If I press preview again, I'll see the same photos, but they'll be displayed with the new color. Notice that the frame is now white around each of the photos. The names that it displays for each of the photos is based on the file name that was loaded into the photo manager. Now I can actually change the title that appears on the HTML web page. And to demonstrate that, I'm now going to press the Publish button. This will actually create HTML ready files. I'm going to go with this, the suggested name, which is Gallery 001. It'll publish that and then it'll open it up in a browser window. Unfortunately, my browser window is just off the area that I'm recording, so I'll just drag that in. And you can see this is a published site. If you look in the top left hand corner, you can see that it's actually titled my gallery, which is the title that we entered. I'm just demonstrating the slideshow aspect now. Okay, that's all good. Now, if I wanted to, I could press the FTP upload button, which is next to the publish button. That will open the FTP dialog. I've already pre-configured my FTP dialog with a website that I use for my test uh, websites. So with that automatically configured, if I just press the upload button, it will upload all of the files that are necessary for the gallery to be fully published. So that concludes this demonstration. I hope you can now see how easy it is for you to configure and upload your own photo gallery.